Okay, today we'll be looking at the famous x -Steel, one of the only MMOs that actually has a decent looking mech, and has even better gameplay. Okay, now, we have to make this fast because it's only about a 10 minute movie that I can make. So, we're going to create a room. My personal favorite is what we call Last Stand. We have Deathmatch, which is exactly what it is. Team Deathmatch, Territory Control, Last Stand, Capture the Flag, Clan Battle. Last Stand is my favorite because of the fact that you can choose how many people you want, the capacity of the room. You can have public or private, of course, and then you can have the level size. Now, as you can see, my level is 7 and rising, and I don't play much, so... Anyway, we have here the difficulty settings. Each one increases with fast numbers. Now, you're still probably wondering what Last Stand actually is. Well, let's go ahead and uh, I'm not quite sure what SD is, so unfortunately sorry about that. But, let's go ahead and create this. I will call it... Because it quite literally is easy. You choose a different of, you know, areas here we have, um, which they grow as your level increases. But, well, I believe that to be true. Anyway, we have here, let's go ahead and go with this one, okay? Uh, let's create, no. Unfortunately, I can't be here very long, so I'm going to go ahead and start before people start joining. If they join, they will automatically be set to join. As you can see, the controls are here. Very simple. Boost is very easy. Um, you can switch your weapons and so on and so forth. Anyway, let's give it a second to load and. Okay. Now, you're supposed to protect these areas that are blue. And there are areas on the map that are indeed red. So. Now I must find out where the attack is coming from, which is where they start spawning, which is here. Since they're AI, they're very easy to kill, but at the same time they come in huge numbers. Hmm. That one's shooting for me from over here? No. Here they are. As you can see, they have different colors. The green is the lowest, being the easiest to kill. Now, my weapons overheat when they come red. I can just switch to a different weapon. I can use boosting. As you can see, I got points. Okay. Now, I, as you can see, people have joined my game. Unfortunately, I'm not sure how long this video will be due to the fact that it's a time limit. This game for itself lasts about 11 minutes, as you can tell on the left-hand side of the screen. Okay. And for killing AIs that are standing around, like this one, you get points for. Because they're not usually supposed to be there. The green bar down here is your energy, the red's your health. The SP is your special move ability. I don't have any special moves at the moment, so this is all set pre I don't have any special moves to use. As you can see I'm still locked on to, which means, hey look, there he is. Okay, as you can see, I have sh these pistols, then I have these shotguns. But... As you can see, these big ones have big, big turrets, or, I'm sorry, big cannons on them. But they are very slow, 
but they do pack a punch. They trade strength and armor for speed and agility, which we have agility, and my guns are decent, so they can actually target them easier. Now, okay, hold on one second. I'm targeted, so I might want to move. I'm about to say something. Okay, and as you can hear, uh, well, you can't hear because it's. Right. Now, the red ones are potentially dangerous because they can use special moves on you. The purple ones are the same way, but they're a bit weaker. The green ones are, of course, the lowest. They can still use special moves on you, of course. You can come here to gain health. Now the hard thing about this last stand is if the AI come here, as you can see that blue bar goes down the longer they're on the target radical, but this will go down until there's nothing left, then it will start to build up red. And as soon as that turns full red, they gain the area and we lose the game. All they have to do is capture one area. Now, this is their stronghold, usually guarded very nicely, which is why I'm going to take the left flank, because as you can see, there's guys up there with heavy guns, and they do a substantial amount of damage. just got defeated, and I was going to show you to it, but I didn't get enough time. So, come over here. You can have swords, shields, big melee weapons, long-range rifles. And these ones here, the ones you can see that look a little bit different and spiky, they heal. So, they're actually very, very dangerous. Um, just because of that aspect. Let them know. As you can see, he's got wings. It's because of the back panels that he has, his booster panels. You can still hit me, but I can still hit you. All I need is a little bit of time to do this, however. As you can see there. Now I'm going to be dealing with a lot more, so I'm going to switch to a different weapon. I need to take cover. Unfortunately, these guys are here to take the punch for them. Mm -hmm. I'm going to press 5 here, which will allow me to gain my health back. As you can see, special move here. That's why they're so annoying. Because it slows you down, but at the same time, it takes a chunk of health. As you can see, most of us take out the big guys first. 